What's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can hard reset, also known as factory reset, your Apple iPhone 16 Pro Max. Let's go. Welcome back to the video. My name is Sergio. In this channel, I make life saving tech videos. So if you're new here, feel free to subscribe and hit the bell while you're down there. All right, let's get right to it. So I'm going to show you how you can do the factory reset, hard reset using a Windows computer. All right, so I'm going to show you two ways to factory reset your iPhone first through the settings. And then the second method will be using the computer. All right, so if you could log into your phone, you can go to settings, you can scroll down to general, in general, scroll all the way down and you're gonna see transfer or reset iPhone towards the bottom. Okay, you can go ahead and select that. Here, uh, you're gonna select the bottom option, erase all content and settings. And then here you're gonna select continue to proceed with the uh, hard reset. Okay, once you're ready, hit erase iPhone and the reset process will begin. However, uh, remember this is letting you know here that everything on your phone will be erased. So back up any information that you want to keep before doing this because everything on your phone will be erased back to its factory state with nothing on the phone. All right, so now I'm gonna show you the second way to do it, which is uh, connecting to the computer. So uh, let's say that you have a password and you can't get into the f iPhone or it is disabled because of putting in the password wrong too many times. This is where this comes in handy. All right, so we're gonna connect the iPhone 16 Pro Max to your computer via USB type C cable. All right, so after you connect your phone to the Windows computer, uh, first thing we're gonna need to do is we're gonna open up iTunes on the computer. I'm also gonna have a link to iTunes down below, so you can download it on your Windows PC. All right, so once you open up iTunes, it should look like this. So once you have it opened up, we're good to proceed to the next step. So now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna put the phone, the iPhone into restore mode. Okay, so how we do that is we're gonna first power the phone off and then we're gonna press and hold volume up and the power lock button at the same time so it can enter restore mode. All right, so let's do it now, let's power the phone off. So uh, I do it by pressing volume up, volume down and pressing and holding the power lock button. Once the phone turns off, we're gonna release and press volume up and the power lock button. So there you go. Now we hold the two buttons until we see the uh, restore screen appear. Continue holding them and there you go. Once you see that, you can let go. The iPhone is now uh, in restore mode. And as you can see, we got this pop-up here on the computer. It says there's a problem with the iPhone that requires it to be updated or restored. So here we can just hit restore. Here it's gonna give us another uh, confirmation box. Uh, hit restore and update. And then here it's uh, just giving us another confirmation here. Hit next, terms and condition, hit agree. So we're gonna have to give it a couple minutes now because it's gonna download the software. As you can see, uh, it says up here seven minutes remaining. So depending on how fast your internet connection is, uh, it will be slower or faster. So uh, the first thing it's gonna do is download the uh, new software that it's gonna install into the iPhone. All right, so after the software is completely downloaded, it's gonna proceed to this, this step, extracting software. So let's wait for it to finish here. Also, one thing that I do wanna mention, very important, is uh, if your iPhone gets out of restore mode during this download process, since it can take a little bit long sometimes, uh, it may get out of restore mode. Just go ahead and put it right back into the restore mode the same way, connect it to the computer and restart the process after the software file has been completely downloaded and it will proceed straight to this extracting software step. All right, so after the extraction process here is complete, it's gonna move on to this step, preparing iPhone for restore. And uh, we're gonna get this loading bar here on the iPhone and uh, we're gonna have to let it just load up all the way. Uh, I think it's gonna do it once or twice. And then the factory reset process will be complete. So uh, let's just give it some more time for it to finish uh, all of these steps. So restoring iPhone firmware now. All right, so uh, now it's restoring iPhone software, almost complete. Now it's verifying iPhone software, verifying iPhone restore. So it looks like it's almost complete here. And there you go. Uh, once you get this message, we are good to go. It says your iPhone has been restored to factory settings. So that means that it is complete. The reset process uh, is now officially done uh, on the computer. And now we just gotta let the iPhone uh, finish up the process here. Uh, it's gonna have one more loading bar and it will be reset uh, back to its factory state. All right, so you can go ahead and disconnect the iPhone. Uh, it looks like the reset process is completed here. Uh, as you can see, it looks like it's at the initial setup of the phone. Yes, it is. So there we go. Now you just gotta go through all of the options here to get your iPhone 16 Pro Max set up. All right, everyone, so that is how you hard reset, also known as a factory reset, your Apple iPhone 16 Pro Max. Go ahead and destroy that like button. Give 
this video helped you and comment down below and let me know. And if you want an epic custom wooden phone case for your phone like these, check out the links down below in the description. That's all for this video. I'll catch you in the next one. As always, peace.